All right, guys, we're over here at the Southeast Texas Craft Barbecue Festival in Port Natchez. They have a lot of different barbecues, and we're gonna check them out. There's also a lot of vendors here, too. Great event. Just put it on. It's from the Old West Barbecue place, and we're gonna check this place out, eat some food, and have a good time. My name is Just Rabelais. I'm with Old West Smoke Company. This is the Southeast Texas Craft Barbecue Festival. The whole reason that we, we created this event was because if you ever go to Austin on 6th Street, you have a vibe with music and food and beer that you don't get in Southeast Texas. Right here on Port Natchez Avenue, we're gonna prove that we have the untapped 6th Street of Austin out here. We've got craft food, we've got craft beer, and we've got great music. Our whole idea behind this design was to create an atmosphere where Southeast Texas could come in and appreciate what we have here locally and also give back to the community. This is a fundraiser for the police department and every shirt that we sell for the festival goes back to a police officer who was recently diagnosed with leukemia. This is a fundraiser and a heck of a freaking party. This is the Korean fried chicken. Got that gochujang jang on there. Sweet, not too spicy. I did get the spicy one, but they're good. They are tasty. Right now, we're gonna see what else we get. I'm gonna try to get something from Old West Smoke Company or probably 1701 Barbecue. All right, man, so this is our turkey bacon and Swiss sausage. It's got a little bit of ranch in there, so nice and cheesy. It's got some cooked bacon, so you can see all the chunks in here. Really crispy, it's delicious. We've been working on it for a while, finally got it turned out. So glad y'all get to come out here and check it out. All right, this is the sausage that he just told us about. It has bacon, cheese. Let's give it a taste. Let's give it without the sauerkraut first. Nice and hot. They're about to sell out, so I came at the right time. That's real good with the cheese. You can taste it, but let's taste it with the sauerkraut. That's the way to do it. Sauerkraut, the, the sausage, it's good stuff. All right, so this uh, festival, it's a good one. I got this uh, Mardi Gras. It's got some like sugar on top of it, but it's good. This is from Buckstein. But uh, other than that, yeah, the festival is good. Lots of vendors here, lots of people, lots of food. But right now I'm waiting for Tony's uh, barbecue. He has a place over here. I, ha I haven't, I've had his brisket before, but it's been a while. So I'm waiting for his tacos. And then I'm trying to get Old West. I don't know if I'll have time. There's a long line for that one too. There's a lot of good lines. That's good. That means there's a lot of people here enjoying the festival, enjoying Port Natchez. Man, Jess, you did a good job with this. All right, so finally you got the barbecue. This is a, I think they're both brisket. I asked for a brisket and a pork, but looks like it's all brisket. Let's give it a try. Y'all see that? It is very good. Very meaty. And lots of cheese too. All right guys, so to end the night, I'm gonna end it with Old West Smoke Company. I got the quesadilla, the barrier quesadilla, and I also got this. This is the ramen barrier. We have put a squeeze of lime on top of this. I think this is actually brisket quesadilla. It doesn't have a barrier, so barrier would be red for sure. So let's taste this. This has the brisket, and it has that sauce, and some cheese. It looks good, let's give it a taste. Smoky, cheesy, and that creamy sauce. I'm not sure what it is. It's kind of like a, almost a ranch, but really good. Let's have one more bite of this one. And it's buttery too. This is good to end the night with. 
the brisket and the, they have even like crispy cheese on the end. Like this piece right here. Mm. That's a favorite of mine for sure. Okay, let's try the uh, Breya ramen. So I've been wanting to try this for a long, long time. Like I said before, right away, you can smell the cumin in here. Very, very cumin-y. And then there's also a radish over here. If you guys can see that, it has the cilantro, the brisket on there, and also the lime on the top. Let's go ahead and squeeze that inside of here. My mouth is watering. And there, y'all see that? All right, let's uh, show y'all this. All right, let's give this a taste. Mix it up a little bit. Mmm. So many flavors. Really good. Like so many spices, you could taste it. Mmm. That's good. The brisket again, super uh, tasty and fatty. And then the noodles. You, you can't hate it on ramen. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna dip my brisket quesadilla into here and give it a taste. That's the way to go. Yeah, good stuff. Not too salty and a good mix of flavors. Definitely a lot of spices. You can taste all the spices inside there. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for the Southie Texas Craft Barbecue Festival. I enjoyed it. You guys, I hope it happens year after year. Great time, lots of food. I am so full. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys in the next one. Peace.